friends and neighbors. Welcome to another production of the program. Here we are on TV once again, once a day, every day. Turn on the machines and live forever. Here we go. I'm alive and I made it back around to Tuesday, which you know, used to be the realest day of the week. Now, now I'm not so sure. Uh oh. Like, what's real? What's the day? What days are? What day is it? Who's re? You know? You know? Uh, my friends out there in TV land, thank you for joining me in this very difficult time. It's a, uh, it's a, it's a crazy world out there. You know, it's like, um, sometimes, like, sometimes it's a crazy world, and then it gets calmed down and waves. Uh, I think I called it well, waves of fear or something. It's like some of these days are crazy and scary and some of them days are regular and people are doing weird things and like you just gotta like you know, some days I've accepted my uh, wild fate and some days I'm like oh man this wild fate of life in the world it's really getting to me it's doing weird things to me so today I'm feeling fine regular day real good real good right but I mean how can you feel real good when the world is in turmoil uh, yesterday I did the program at value 45 today I didn't go anywhere I did make some food I made some curry for myself it's a Japanese style curry so I got the bricks in there I got some garbanzos and potatoes and put some okra but I think the okra mostly melted I think the potatoes melted too it all pretty melty it's good though the okra Slimed it, just kind of slimed everything. Uh, well, maybe we'll check the phones, see who's on the phone. Anybody going to get on the Zoom? Real. Go to whatyhwm.com. Get on the Zoom, and if you want to call them, call them, brother. 360. 8364384. Call new message. Get yourself on TV. Mark, the guitar player, left a couple messages. Let's check in. What you saying, Mark? Two steps back, huh? You want to take two steps forward, one step back. Um, and if you do that enough times, you're smooth having moving forward. Is two steps forward, one step back a bad thing? Or a good thing? Like maybe it's good because you, I don't know. At least I don't know. It seems like it's good, like just like in the phrase using the phrase, but I don't know what the, the idiom is supposed to mean anymore.
My ankle. Ah, uh, my ankle. My brother might be at my grandma's today on Tuesday. Inky Doodle. It's similar songs. Hello, hello, hello. Uh, hi, Rebecca. It's a program on TV. Hey, How are hey. you? Here, here, here. Here, here, here. Live, here. live, live. Live and love. Hello. Live, 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 Mark. Live, live, Rebecca. Yeah. <laughs> How are you? Good. It's a program on TV. Yeah. What are you? Oh, what are you doing? Jeans on Zoom. Hello. I just sat here Hi, drinking Gene. some ice water. Oh yeah, how's that? Well, you got ice in it. And you got water in it. Ice, water. That's good. Yeah. How do you make your ice? In the cubes. In the two oh, cubes. Cubes of ice. Yeah, I thought you said tubes. No. Not tubes, cubes. Do you go for ice, Gene? What was what now? Gene's on Zoom. Can you hear oh. me? Can you hear me? Yeah, I... Mark says yeah. hi. Do you go for ice? Yeah. No, I had a big life change. I used to be a huge ice cruncher. Yeah, you love to crunch ice. an ice, I remember. Yeah, right, but no longer. How about yeah. just in the water, though? So, I don't want it there. No, wa no ice. I don't, hurt your teeth. I don't do ice either. I'm a no ice. No, uh, no ice, Mark. It's too cold. I like my water. It's too cold, cold for ice? I like my water room temperature. Oh. And then I can just really bring it down. Uh, yeah. What's for dinner, Mark? Oh, uh, we're not eating. You're not eating anything? No, we had lunch today at, uh, with TV dinners. Yeah, barbecue? Yeah. Yeah, it's your favorite flavor. You ever get any other flavors? Uh-uh. Yeah, just stick with the one. Yeah. That's good. What's Rebecca doing, counting something? She's uh, sitting here talking to herself. <laughs> well, all right. All right. Well, I'm glad you're doing good, Mark. I, I listened to your messages. Okay. You guys take it easy now. Okay. You too. Bye, Mark. Bye. Hi, Jean. Hi. Hi. How are you? What are you doing? Good. You on a... Guess what? Are you in a new yeah. place? I'm in a cabin in Vermont. <laughs> Whoa. It looks very it's rustic. Nice. Wow, Isn't it nice? that's like an actual cabin, yeah. Yeah, it's got like a loft. Beam. That's, that's like Lincoln. Got this nice thing there. Wow. Oh, you know, you know what is outside? The woods. About uh, like a hundred, well, at least be a hundred uh, uh, lightning bugs. Hundred lady? Oh, lightning bugs. <laughs> Not that many is there, is, but here's one right there. That yeah. little blinking thing? Yeah. Wow. The thing is stuck in between the two doors. What do they look? Oh. What do they look like? Um. When they're uh, 
What are the when they like other than just being lit up? They look like flies. Yeah, and it's just their butt stick. Oh, it might have to, you know. Shoot, let's keep. I can turn on the light. It just fell down there someplace. Mm. Uh, well, I don't know where. It is. Oh, it's in my fucking face. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. See? I think that's it. Can you see it? There. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. And now we'll go like this, and you can see it. Do its thing. Whoa! Yeah! Welcome to Fireflies. I'm gonna open the door and let it go free. Raining. Flies. Okay. Fireflies. Yeah, yeah. Fireflies. Yeah. And then they're slowly beeping all over the place. That's nice. Is this your yep. new? Is this your new home? How are you gonna get to Oregon? How am I gonna get there? I'm not. Oh. He's there. He's oh, he's there. Oregon. Yeah, he's there. So I'm. It's, it's nice. There's no. It's, there's no. Um. Phone, cell phone. You're in a. Cat, are you in the woods? I'm in the woods. Yep. Wow. Is it, is it scary? No. No. <laughs> Like, <laughs> my only experiences with Cabin in the Woods are in horror movies. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, that's the problem. You didn't, like, live in one. Yeah. And not have that to you ever happened ever. <laughs> More of my situation. No. Been, been lucky in cabins, or been lucky in the woods so far. That's good. Yep. Oh. Yeah. So you no more New you're out of New York then. Uh no more New York. Uh, there's a nanny there. Take care of two babies. Or something I don't know how to do. I still would like to try, but you know they gotta do their life. I gotta have pretend to have a life. Yeah. Uh, I'm trying you've to got some new decisions in back there? Yeah, I right? mo moved. Uh, I, I moved around the corner. I didn't really move anywhere. But uh, in the basement, not. I'm in, in the, the basement, different... and now, but I just like moved uh, around the corner. To... Mm -hmm. right, I just turned 90 degrees. Okay. Very nice. So now I'm uh, I'm turned. I don't know if you look. You look at YouTube. You can see it more. But I got a whole desk. I, I put. I'm off the floor. I'm on a desk. I'm on a chair. Okay. Sitting, I'm sitting on a chair. I know. Uh, yeah. You no. don't need this floor. That's your your power. No more floor for me. You I'm a, have a good cushion. In your chair. The chair is phone? like like a, maybe some kind of like piano bench. I would say. It's it's got a cushion on it. It's it's fine. It's like an electric piano bench. Uh, electric piano. Yeah, it's not a wood it piano bench. Old. Not a wood piano bench. I think like a like a regular piano bench is like made out of wood and it's got like a a, a, a spot for music. You know? No. I think that piano. Yeah, that's so, a. No, because that that is. Music sits on the piano, not on the bench. The, inside the bench, like the the bench has a oh, little com sucks. compartment, you know. Yeah. You know what yeah. I'm talking about? I I do. That's yep. where you put your music. This is uh, just like a, a fake. I think it's fake leather, and it's collapsible. So I think it's for electronic keyboards instead of uh, uh, traditional pianos. I would say. All right. What's yeah. happening? Oh, I'm getting I'm getting private messages. 
Oh no. I should no tell way. them I should tell them to uh, to get on the program instead of uh, sending me private messages. But yeah. uh, I have my That's phone nice. my phone is private. Yeah. I should maybe get a new system because you're just like on my phone <laughs> still. Yeah. But that's how it is. I don't mind. You're on my phone. How far is um New York and Vermont? I don't know. <laughs> five hours, I'm going to say. Five and a half hours. So you've been driving a lot, huh? You're like driving back and forth to Vermont and New York? No, I was going to Greenfield. So oh, Massachusetts. Hours. Okay, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. So not, and then how far is Massachusetts and New York? Uh, three hours. Three really? hours, and then this is in five, but it's in the same direction? I don't know. But <laughs> it's two more. That's the brilliant thing about Greenfield, right? It's sort of within striking distance of Vermont and New York. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. But now you're, in, now you're in Vermont, and you're going to be staying in New Vermont for a while? Or just until that guy's uncle comes back? <laughs> I think I might not be there when he comes back. I might just be here for a month. And if then, I can find housing in Greenfield. But then what if I can't? But Phil is waiting for me in Greenfield. And also, I would probably, like, maybe try to get a job in Greenfield. And, like, act as adults act where one gets an income, pays for where you live. But yeah, no more school? You're not going to go back to that school? I don't want to. Yeah, no. yeah. Um, school of labor. I wonder if they're going to they're gonna, they're gonna open back up. I don't know, yeah. Uh, I think there's like, you know, the union is asking people to be on the reopening committee. I'm sure there's lots of input and strategizing. And, yeah. Uh, uh where are all the kids? What are they gonna do with the kids? Because school is kind of like babysitting too, like government-sponsored babysitting. So yeah. if the kids can't go to school, where are they gonna go? Yeah. They gotta go somewhere. Right. Right. Uh, yeah. What a what a world. Um, what a world. What a world. The, did you go see your parents? I did. I went there today. I only. I mostly sat on the porch, went on a walk with the dog and my dad, and I <laughs> borrowed, I guess I put on some of my shoes that are like 15 years old that were upstairs in my old bedroom. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, they fell right apart. They fell apart. They fell apart. Yep, and I was about half a mile from home. And so I was walking without like a sole on one shoe and a toe on the other shoe in the wet, wet they, ground, because there was huge rain and thunderstorm on my drive over. Oh. I was told because it was pouring so hard. Yeah, and you were driving in that? Yeah. Wow. Well, but I don't know. It doesn't have anything to do with the shoes, other than the ground was very wet. Yeah. So was, Maybe they help, it helped with the deterioration. It seems like, how come only 15 years they wouldn't uh, disintegrate, because, like, I've seen shoes that are old, pretty old. People have vintage yeah. shoes. Like, why do they fall apart? Well, I think they're cheap. They're cheap to begin with? Yep. Yeah. Uh. Cheap shoes, the one, I bet you, well, let's see, maybe they're older than 15 years. I bet you that they were, they're black shoes, so I think they were for working in a restaurant, probably the shed in the Vermont. Oh, uh, yeah, where I was a bus person. So maybe it was even more than 15 years. Maybe it was in, like, 2001. More like so 20. 20 years, yeah. Uh, I don't know, <laughs> shoes are falling apart, though. Time flies by, it's weird. Time is weird. Um, yep. Do your parents kept your bedroom? Yeah, what would they do with it? I don't know. Most parents, don't they turn it into, like, an office or a den? They got a nice, they've already got a TV room and an office. Well, I guess, right? Yeah, an office. My dad has an office. Yeah. Huh. Computer room. 
called it the computer room, TV room, and the living room, and a kitchen. Oh yeah, okay. And so it's, is it the guest room too? But it's just got your stuff in it. Uh yeah, they did uh, like re- put up, they painted. I had wallpaper, you know, that was dumb. <laughs> they took it down. They did, yes. What, and what, what was it? I, got, I had bunk bed before, and now it's a a big big kid bed. What kind of wallpaper was it? Uh, it was like little square polka dots. Teal, pink, blue. Square polka dots, huh? <laughs> you know, like little, like confetti, and then polka polka squares. Like, just little things, little colors, and then there was like a yeah sack on like one third of the way up that was uh, uh, sneakers, glow in the dark sneakers. Mm. Polka squares. Like um, I don't know. I don't know if I've ever had wallpaper before. I don't know why, uh, where you get wallpaper, but. I just had it because we, we made an addition onto the house to have two bedrooms when I was like maybe five or something. Yeah. Because that's in the same room as my brother. You get to decide the wallpaper? So I did, yeah. You wanted polka squares? Yeah, uh, I guess so. I think confetti is the word. Confetti, confetti. yeah. Yeah. Multicolored polka thought, squares. Yeah. I thought since they were sneakers, they would be cool when I was older, too, you know? But Sne- now, cool later. S- sneakers are cool. They're kicks. Shoe, yeah. shoe I, culture. I, yeah, kicks. The kicks. Yeah. Look at my shoes. Uh, I like shoes. What are your interests? Shoes. <laughs> you must be cool. Yeah. You got shoes That's on? What, I, I, I what kind of shoes you got now? Did you, uh, they, 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 your, your shoes fell apart, but you went back and you you wore shoes too there, and oh, they fell apart. What, so what, my dad was very nice, and he pointed out that my feet were going to get very wet on the walk, and suggested I get new, different shoes. They were very thoughtful over there for yeah. me, because I, like, wasn't going inside, right? Yeah. I'm going to test tomorrow and hopefully be sort of in the clear. But they were thoughtful. And my mother went upstairs and found those in. What what shoes you got on now? I don't have any shoes on. No shoes. Me neither. But my shoes are upstairs. I'm taking them off when I go inside. Uh, It's going to be hard to buy shoes now if my... My current shoes are on the, uh, the, I have one more pair of backup shoes after my current shoes go away. But then, um, I don't know what I'm going to do when, but it's probably going to be for not, for many months before I need new shoes after the backup shoes. I start wearing the backup shoes because I think my shoes I'm wearing now have another like maybe a month on them at mm. least. And then my other ones, and then I'll have another like half a year in them. But then hopefully, I guess if I'll be, in a half a year, maybe I'll be able to go back to the shoe store. Yeah. Well, what about the looking for the same ones on the internet? Yeah, just like the them. same the same size and model and stuff. That might be good. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go back, go to the shoe store. I don't know when it's gonna be done. Uh, <laughs> I don't know when I'm gonna go back to the stores, but it might be a well, while. Shoes are so hard. Yeah, I yeah. don't like buying shoes. Oh, uh, I don't I either. I I only wear one, I have one kind of shoes, and then when they wear out, then I put on the next shoes, but I only have one at a time. Yep. I like sandals. I got some sandals now. Chacos, you know, had the same kind of chacos. Chacos. They're just simple, they tie, or they cinch on your foot. Yeah. Um. What's been going on? It's been very hard to stay up late. I'm very, I feel, yeah, I'm very proud of myself. Oh, you did? I'm proud of you. Are you you sleepy? I'm sleepy, yeah. Oh, okay. Um, Well, you know, feel free to go to sleep if you want to, but do you have, uh, uh, you have water and and, uh, electricity in the cabin? Yes. Guess what, though? Guess what? I had to turn on the water. Wow. Yes. And guess what? 
What? I flooded the basement. <laughs> oh my god! Like bad? Um, it felt. It seemed sort of dramatic. <laughs> but when I walked down there, when I went down the first time, I noticed that there was puddles of water, sort of in a diagonal across the whole basement. So then, and when I <laughs> went down again and had flooded the basement. There was water in that same path, which means that it seems like it came from the same place, you know? So what I did was I turned on the water the way the person told me to. It was, first of all, hard to get in touch with. I was supposed to call Eddie uh, to find out how to turn on the water, but the phone service there here. So then I went driving away to try to find something. And then we could talk with him. But anyway, oh, I also didn't have the key to get in the door. Uh -huh. So it all took time. So I did the right thing. I turned the red nozzle. I flicked the thing on the fuse box to turn on the pump. I went upstairs to see, to turn, make sure all the spigots were open so I could flush the water through and the air out. And then I was proud of myself. <laughs> and I stopped paying attention for a while or I got some stuff out of the car and then I went down in the basement and <laughs> yeah. the hot water <clears throat> uh, How? So I hadn't even noticed before that was the next thing I was supposed to turn on which I didn't know about at first well what was uh, that there was, there was a it was spurting out of it very fast there was uh, water gushing out oh no How, yeah. how much that water is in the basement like a couple inches or what no, just a thin layer. Yeah, and what kind of is it? Uh, dirt. It around. Is it dirt? Um. Well, let's go check it out. Okay. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's, wow. That's that seems like. Okay, but you know, uh, and then I mean, yeah, I turned off the water, and then I think that the person who was here before, like his nephew, had, um and drained the hot water heater probably into the damn face. My impression. So I think it's his fault. And then he left it open. So yeah, then, it seems like it shouldn't be easy to flood the basement. But like, yeah. like whoops. Like, yeah. we got oh, here. that's like a real basement. I thought maybe it would be. Now, here, look at this. It's great. Not a problem. Just some puddles. Yeah, There's most of it went away, but there is like stuff down there. I hope. I mean, yeah, see that shiny there. Yeah. I thought uh, maybe it'd be dirt, but there is like things that can get wet that don't need to be getting wet down there, right? Yeah, but it it seems like everything looks up that's supposed to not get wet to some degree. Yeah, they, they probably are aware of this of of the basement getting flooded like sometimes, right? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, and I got a text. He said, "Don't worry, it's happened many times." Oh, okay. Or it's, it's before. So that felt great. Yeah. That stopped it from from flooding more, and then I, and a little bit later, had the courage to turn on the hot water heater, and now I have hot water Wi-Fi. I turned on the Wi-Fi. Wow. Uh, and. Yeah, water, electricity, hot Wi-Fi, the electricity is on. But I'm very... Everything. It's slightly dirty, so I don't have to worry about... Oh, well, I'm cleaning. I got some cleaning stuff from my mother, so I could, well, I could clean. Yeah, you clean the basement with the water. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. That's the first thing. <laughs> yeah, it looks a little bit Rinse it. Um... There's not, what about like the water heater? There's a little base on the water heater, so it's not going to mess up the water heater. I guess it's full of water on the inside, so then if it's getting some water on the outside, it should be fine. Well, I was a little nervous because it says, do not try to turn on the water heater if it's been submerged. And I was like, well, it wasn't submerged, but some of the, some of the wires are wet. Oh, what is, yeah, what is submerged? Submerged means, like, completely underwater. 
Like Yeah. But yeah. Like you're not submerged until you're like all the way under. Like if your head or whatever is still above the water, I don't think you've submerged into water yet, so like but but I that, think you're talking about not the whole tank, but more like the lighting area, which is on the face. Oh. So I wondered how wet would be trouble for me. And I was very glad when there was no explosion because of gas. No and shortage, yeah. Water. So you got hot water? I have hot water. It's great. I haven't taken a shower. The, the bath was very, very filthy. So that's one reason why I got that cleaner. And I washed it okay. And I think I might wash it one more time before I use it because it was so filthy. Oh, let me wear your shoes in there. Um, I uh, yeah, got it. I I've been. I guess it's different. I I'm like haven't gone anywhere. Uh, still haven't left like left the block. So I'm yeah. like you're going all these places, but then even if I go outside, I come back and I get in the shower immediately because I'm afraid of the outside world. <laughs> so, but uh, you're like going around doing things. I guess there couldn't be too many, too much virus in the deep woods by yourself. <laughs> no. Yeah. I think it's from people's grass and uh, spittle. It's more of a spittle. It's thing a spittle. <laughs> what spittle? What's the difference between sp what spittle and spit? Spittle's just like when it's flying out, and you're like, "Did you spit on me?" And like, no, it's a spittle. Yeah, I feel like it's a little. It's a really. It's a. It's like mini spit. Yeah. Spittle. Spit tool, not full on yeah. spit. Um. I wonder who's watching on YouTube, but it's like, uh, we're live on YouTube still. I don't know if everybody's there. I want to call my grandmother, too, before the show's over. We still have, uh, half over about half an hour right now. Um, uh, I'm going to call grandma, okay? Good. All right. All right, I'll be fine. Here goes. What are, you, what are you eating in Vermont, or in the cabin? Do you bring food there? Yeah. Um... I had peanut butter and jelly, <laughs> and I had. Oh, it's ringing. Old English what? Call grandma. P B and J. Moshi moshi. Moshi moshi. Hi grandma. Hi. How are you? Good. How are you? I'm okay. Who, where are you? I'm. I, I. This is Kenny. I'm in the basement. I'm at my house. You want to talk to Andrew? Yeah, well, how are you? I'll talk to you first. Huh? I'm talking to okay. you first, okay? Yeah, okay. Are you drinking water? I drink water, yes. Okay, because... I, I got a pancake, too. Oh, yeah? Pancakes? Yeah. I think it's pancake. Yeah, I think savory pancake. Savory? I'm make a pancake. That's good. Do you like it? I don't know yet. Oh, I'm yeah. Not yet. You haven't even tried it? I'm going to try it pretty soon. All right. Oh, oh, huh? Sourdough. What? Sourdough. Sourdough. Sourdough pancakes? Oh, he said sourdough. Huh. Sourdough bread? Try it. See how it is. I want to know. I don't know. I want to know so, how it is. Okay. So you're going to talk to under your hair. Okay? Okay. You talk. Hello. Hello. She eating pancakes? I want to. See, is she gonna like it? You make it? I don't know. It's the Chinese pancake. You make it? I made it. Sa sourdough pancake, huh? Yeah. What's in there? Savory. I put. I put sesame seeds and kimchi on it. Sesame seeds and kimchi and. Well, do you make it out of flour? Yeah. Wow. Flour and kimchi and sesame seeds and stuff. Savory Asian pancake. Fancy. I want to. I yeah. want to see if she's gonna like it. You should get her to try it. All right. Try it, Grandma. Try the. Try the pancake. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> Good. She's, she's cut it up, she says. Oh. Oh, 
a knife. I thought she said very nice. I need a knife. <laughs> what are you doing? Making pancakes. You <laughs> making Chinese pancakes? Making pancakes. Making Chinese what pancakes. Doing? What are you doing? Why don't, why don't you come over and eat? The virus. The virus, he says. Virus or what? There's a, there's a pandemic, Grandma. Yeah, yeah. Oh. What do you say? Grandma said mushy mushy today when she answered the phone. Yeah. That's like, uh, is it because of uh, Michi? I don't know, maybe she can, are you confused, Grandma? Who do you, you think it was when you answered the phone? I don't know. Uh, this is salty. Too salty. Okay. Don't don't use it then. Yeah. Yeah. Too salty. You gotta drink water. Yeah, you gotta drink water, Kenny says. Okay. Yeah. Uh, she was dehydrated like last week, Jean. She got dehydrated and uh was not doing too good, so she so she wasn't drinking enough water. Oh no. So it's not just me being over the top by it. Someone to drink water every day. Yeah. It's for real. Oh. She's on medication that dries her out. Uh oh. Yeah. Does she like their water or anything? Drink uh, What? Do you oh. like water or anything that's water ish that might be more motivating? Celery? Yes, sir. Like bubbly water. A bubbly water? Like vodka? Yes, yeah, she likes vodka. Uh -huh. Well, that's not hydrating, is it? <laughs> I don't think so. What about yeah? Does, yeah. does Grandma like soda water? <laughs> Grandma doesn't like that. Oh, she... I don't like it at all. All right. What about apple juice? She doesn't like the pancakes. It's awful. Apple juice. Oh no. <laughs> yeah, it's awful. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I think it tastes good. Yeah. yeah. Awful. awful. Yeah. That's too bad. What are you gonna do now? You gotta eat something. You gonna make it something else? No, we already ate dinner earlier. I, I, this is just leftover from sourdough. Oh, what's uh? You made bread? Yeah, I made a pancake. Yeah, but did you make bread? Why do you have sourdough? Because I have a sourdough starter. It's my pet. Oh. How was? What did you eat for dinner? I got kung pao chicken from Trader Joe's. Yeah, does she like that? Yeah. That's good. Eating grandma. Got to feed grandma, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, how's how's it going? Like you just like living with grandma and the panda I mean I guess it's the same as same as before, huh? Yeah. You uh getting cabin fever from living with grandma and staying at home? <coughs> no. No, that's good. Keep you have people thing. that work with that you like? What? Does he work with people that he likes? Do you work with people that you like? Sure. Sure. Yeah. That's good. That's, that's the bet. Yeah. You got friends at work. Um, what are you, what's on TV? Grandma hates those pancakes. Oh yeah, why does she keep going back and trying it? Or she... <laughs> that's awful. <awesome. laughs> <laughs> it's not a breakfast pancake. Chinese pancake. I made it. Awful. Awful. <laughs> I've um. What? What? What's on? What's Grandma watching on TV? I don't know. You know that they want to cancel uh, the cops on in general. You know, cancel culture. What about it? Cancel culture. You know what's next? 
They want to cancel any any anything with the cops on TV, huh? Right, 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 right. Yeah. You know, I don't care for the police. <laughs> to put it lightly. Yeah, I don't I don't care for them. Um but uh oh. but um I like crime procedural television. It's like, a hole. It's a hole. So, like, you ever watch, like, Law and Order? Yeah. Or, like, CSI, like, CSI and Law and Order, or, uh, I like that movie Seven, you know, with the police. Right. Um, but maybe that, those movies and the, the shows are, are, uh, portraying the police in a positive light because they're never racist. Yeah. <laughs> they're, they're, like, real cops, you know? The, the Daily Show had like a, a montage of cops just beating the fuck out of people in an interrogation room. On on uh on in fiction. Yeah. Yeah. Just like on any, just on different shows. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's there's, fun. There's, there's, like, no, there's no other show on TV that shows like professions like solving problems, you know, by beating people. Up. Well, <laughs> yeah, it's true. There's nobody else. Like nobody else gets paid to hurt others. <laughs> yeah, I was thinking like like I used to say this thing about superheroes, and like superheroes, all they have are weapons. Yeah. So it's like, what are you gonna do? Like hurt people? <laughs> like that's all they really actually are doing. They're like you're a hero. It's like yeah, yeah. I've got. They just. I, the right people, the bad. People. Yeah, the superheroes hurt the bad people, but like, yeah, I'm real good at punching. Like, <laughs> that's like all they can really do. That's all the police can really do, eat too. So it's like, what are they gonna do? But they're gonna, they're gonna get rid of. Uh, are they still pissed off about that dog cop, <laughs> the cartoon dog cops? What is that show? <laughs> uh, what? I don't know. They were like. I remember they were complaining about that cartoon dog, like, somebody tried to cancel, like, this kid's cartoon dog show where the dogs were with the police, and they're like, oh, we gotta protect this cartoon dog show, <laughs> like, the, the... That's real. Paw Patrol, canceled. Yeah, is it actually canceled? <laughs> they're like, what about the children? The children love Paws Patrols. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, it's gonna be uh, in the future when, when people are playing, co they're gonna play cops and robbers, the kids. It's gonna be like cowboys and Indians for us, you know. I guess that's like, like, uh, like, like uh, culturally offensive terms from the past, you know. <laughs> like, yeah. Hey, you want to play cowboys and Native Americans? <laughs> I don't know if anybody's ever gonna say that one, but uh, hey, that's uh, offensive for some reason now. Well. It's because, like, I, I think that you're, you're, you're portraying a race of people as a group, like a cowboy. <laughs> you know, it's like a cowboy is like a maybe a, a job or like a, a hat. Yeah, like a, like, a, like a gaucho or something. A, a cowboy is like a group, a, a group of people or a job. And an, Indi uh, an Indian is a Native American is a race of people. <laughs> cops. I mean, I think. Uh, I mean, this is a bad joke, but they're gonna do like cops versus um, blacks. You know, like cowboys and Indians. So because they're racist, because the police are racist. In the future. Yeah, the kids. <laughs> yeah. That's a good joke. It's a it's a good joke. <laughs> um, <they're>, yeah. <laughs> well, it's a bad joke though, but they're they're bad. Uh, <laughs> the, the, uh, hello. Uh, hello. 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 Can you hear me? Who's, yes. Hello. I can hear you. Hi. Hi. Where are you coming from? Zoom. Zoom. Oh. Is it yellow fellow? Yeah. How are you? Good. How are you? Good. Oh, there you are. That was that yeah. was weird. I you started like you started saying things and I didn't know where the voices were coming from. <laughs> <I don't know. laughs> just a just a voice from from the ethers. Yeah. Yeah. 
Um, are you watching uh, YouTube at all right now? Because me, I'm talking to my brother about uh, uh, cancel. I guess I can't cancel all television with police. That's yeah. That's uh, I don't know. I think some of that stuff's going too far. But also, I'm not. Yeah. <laughs> you can't talk about it. Hey, what would you say? Um, I think some of that stuff is going a little too far. You want them to keep the show, the cop shows? It's a joke. Are you supporting the police? Yeah, I like, I, 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 yeah, yeah, I like Chief Wiggum. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Chief Wiggum. They're going to do up in The Simpsons. I mean, there's like, it's like this, uh... Yeah. It's like pretty wild, though, because... <laughs> what, 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 are we going to pretend that the cops don't play any role in society? Don't... There's no role in which we need the cops for anything in any level of society anymore. We're gonna shun them like they're Nazis. Well, like, it's like I know we need reform for the we need reform for the police, but we can't fucking pretend that they're, they're Nazis either. It should be you know, it, it should be ridiculous. different groups. It should not be a police. It should be like mental health counselors, and yeah, like but, yeah, but yeah, but uh, yeah, you need more support areas like that. But like. There is something that needs to be done when your neighbor's house is being broken into the into the middle of the night, and you're not the one that wants to go out with your gun and take care of it. There's nothing you, know you can. I mean? There's nothing you can do at that point though, because they're already in there, and the police are gonna like by the time the police show up, all they can do is find the guy later. I yeah, but it's yeah. There's a lot of issues with it, but it's you really need some sort of force maybe like violent like maybe violent crime officers are like different people. Because the problem is that the, the police are have guns all the time, and they well, show up at, just, like... It's, it's also just human nature to have a governing force for any society. Like, what's the first thing that happens in, like, in Baz or Chop when, when, around the border? It's like there's people with guns protecting it. You know what I mean? It's like Lord of the Flies. It happens with any group of people. Yeah, um, well... It's about, it, I don't know. It's... They don't need so much money, at least. But uh, we can. No, they, they don't need to be highly militarized, for sure. I'm, yeah. not, I'm not like Mr. Joe Crow, cop man. I'm just saying it's. I think it's a lot more nuanced than a lot of the conversations I end up hearing a lot of the time. Yeah. Um, Get rid of them. Get rid of them. But uh, <laughs> no more. But uh, the, they're gonna. What about TV though? Because I like yeah, I like TV shows. Yeah, we need, we need Mr. For, Mr. <laughs> Mr. For Wiggums. Yeah, <laughs> what about the uh, Wiggums gonna, gonna like they're gonna are they gonna do, address it on The Simpsons where he's like out of a job now, or like? I don't think, <laughs> but I don't think that he's uh, uh what is it? Not idolized. What it held up? What is the word? No, he's like a dopey like I like to eat donuts. Yeah, yeah he's, he's like bad. Of- he's a bad cop. That's like yeah. he's not. He doesn't do anything. Good. That's why maybe they leave him in there as a satire. He's always been a satire in the police anyway. But like, uh, I like see like I'm saying I like CSI that TV show, but that's gone long gone anyway. But I guess um, I could do without it. Twin Peaks. Twin Peaks is off air forever. Yeah, I like Twin Peaks, but that's the FBI. Uh, nobody's like saying defund the FBI. That's a, that's a Twin Peaks police department. But the FBI, I I think killed Martin Luther King. Yeah. Yeah. Well, possible. Yeah. Uh, and JFK? Yeah, maybe. The CIA killed JFK. The FBI killed Martin Luther King. The CIA? The you CIA killed it? JFK, and the FBI killed Martin Luther King, and the the, the police killed George Floyd. What? Do you think, did you, did you watch The Irishman? Um, no. They say that the mob killed JFK long. with oh. with the help of with help from uh, the government. The FBI? I don't know. If it, I forgot who it was. Probably CIA. I think the CIA killed JFK, and the, F, uh, the FBI killed, uh, arranged to kill uh, Martin Luther King, though. Martin Scorsese is just, like, calling it? Is that what he, or it's not calling it if it's after the fact. No, um, he's, telling, he's telling the story of this guy who, who says that he did all this. Stuff. Oh wait! Oh, that's where that movie ends up going. I didn't know that. Spoilers! Yeah, it's, a, it's an autobiography of this guy, but he could be lying. Oh, they—they they have a lot of movies about. Like, what about like you know they made like Hogan's Heroes? 
You remember that show? It, it's like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You know Hogan's okay. Heroes, Gene? Yeah. No. Hogan's Heroes no. was like, what, 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 what? That was like in the 70s or the 60s, right? Like, it seems like something bad. Yeah, the Hogan's know. Heroes was like a comedy about about Nazis. <laughs> Oh, yeah, but yeah. in the 70s, but that was like, so if you but cannot... They weren't, they weren't like, hey, we love Nazis. It was like, hey, look at these Nazis that we're making fun of. Yeah, they were the bad guys. Yeah. But uh, it was like silly, though. They were like silly bad guys. Right. right. But I don't know. They can do that. They can keep the police going. Uh, or have TV shows about the police. But the police are still, <laughs> still around. I guess they're going to cancel... Cancel police television while they're still around? Well, I think that would just make people more afraid of the police. And, you know, yeah. if it's like now we can't, they're, they're, gov they're still governing us, like that's still going to happen, and yet we like don't talk about them on television anymore? That seems a little weird. Yeah. We, it's like, well, like Freddy Krueger. We're going to try to like Freddy Krueger them. <laughs> like, like, they don't exist. I don't yeah. believe in you. I don't believe in you. Like, sure. Why don't you louder? Like, I don't know if that will, that will work for them. I, I don't think we're going to have as many people who are going to want to be recruited into the police. I think that we're going to see that go down, potentially. Also, I don't know. Um, I mean, there is, there's just a, yeah, we have to find some new creative ways as a society to deal with crime then, if it isn't going to be through police, because crime isn't going to go away. Yeah, but know? crime, what what is crime and who decides what crimes are? And well, what do you think crime is then? Because yeah. crime is when somebody steals. Steals what? Well, who has property, and what do you have this property oh, so, for? Okay, so we're okay. Then what are we going back to? Nobody has items that they work for and maintain anymore, or property. What? So what? What? What, what happens? Well, who owns most of everything right now? We well, that's true, but we, it can't be a, like I throw our hands up in the air and we yeah, go to sc scratch. You know. And they're holding it above us. Yeah, if you don't have prop. I mean, I'm 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 pretty much willing to give away anything I have unless you really want this stuff. Like, so I don't know if anybody else is either. Like, I don't and then really. I feel uncomfortable taking property from my parents because they're white. And I know. Well, of color haven't been able to receive any property, so I yeah. think property is like you know. So, but I hear you. Like, we have to have some kind of law and order, but it, yeah. it's just. It's distressing that it's so fucked. Like, yeah. said, oh, this has fucked everything up. I, 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 I worry because I, yeah, I want things to progress in a more positive direction, but I think in, people also need to be able to work together to be able to make anything good happen, and I see a lot of division more than anything yeah. else out in the country I, right now. We could at least... I think it's often, like, the loud voices are what we hear, and that it feels divisive, but that's yeah, kind of, like, yeah. pulls the center over. You're right. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I've been hearing I that too. Be around, like being around it either. You know, like. Mm -hmm. That's a good yeah. point. I forget that sometimes. Yeah. Uh, I'm a, I'm gonna record a message of the future. All right. Sorry, I'm getting too excited tonight. No. No, dude, don't be sorry. Get big, get yeah. buck, get buck, <laughs> yell for. Sometimes I don't. What? Oh, what did you say? Oh, I said get buck. Get buck, get buck, you know. Get buck, buck, get buck. I'm not familiar with that. Um, buck wild, I think is what it's for. Buck. Oh, buck wild, hog wild. Hog wild. Go hog get wild. Get hog. Nobody says get hog. Though. Buck, get buck, buck is wild. a. That's a thing people say. Is that a West Coast thing? I I, I haven't heard it. Buck wild. Getting buck. I think it's like a. <laughs> Getting buck. Getting buck. I, I think like is it. like to me is like a. I don't know, is it like a rap, <laughs> like a rap slang or something? Like, get buck, get buck, like, oh. I think it's rap, I think it's rap music stuff. Um, I'm going to look this up. Oh, you're going to look it up? Oh, no, it up. after the show, after the show. Right. Hey, future, it's us in the past. Hello, future. Hey, get buck wire. Uh, hey, cancel future. culture. Yo, fellas on the phone, Gene's in a cabin in the woods. I'm studying my uh, culture of consideration and guiding principles for my steak restaurant. Steak 48. Yeah. <laughs> All right, bye, future. Yeah. It's called Steak 48. Yeah. That's a funny. <laughs> that's a funny name. Uh, really I love it. How to? It's like how do you? Restaurant that's probably never gonna open. 
Yeah, how to I do didn't say that, how to do it, customer service? It's like a book on it. Yeah, it's very detailed. It's probably it's a good guide if anyone would take it seriously. But I'm not what sure do you do? Will. What do you do if somebody is really rude to you? Like you um, just become more subservient to them. <laughs> yeah. You know. <laughs> what if they're attacking you personally? I apologize. Oh yeah. <laughs> and I get somebody else to help them. Oh yeah. yeah. Uh, I don't like their face. You say I'm sorry. I'm ugly or something. <laughs> yeah. No, I, I don't. I don't have to give in. But I just have to say, very good, sir. Uh, oh, very good, sir. <laughs> and, and back away, back away slowly. Yeah, yeah. No matter what you say. Uh, very good, sir. Very good, sir. Yeah. Never, oh man. Yeah. <sighs> guess real. Guess perception is reality, Kenny. Yeah. Yeah. That's, I mean, that's pretty much what I would do in most, most situations anyway. If somebody was like trying to uh, attack me, like I'd let, I try to. Oh, 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 oh! I had a good story for the show the other day, but then I forgot. Um, it's a story from something I saw on the street. I was on a food delivery, and uh, I was just biking down. It was kind of, it's a road where you shouldn't really bike on in Center City. It's a little like cars kind of zoom by. It's a wide road. And this one trucker was biking by me, and he got, he just, he was speeding by me, like, way too close. I know it was a type of, like, it was like the type of thing where he, like, sped up all of a sudden when he was passing me um, to prove a point. Like, oh, uh, bike trucker off the road. And before I could even think twice about it, like, it just left my mouth. I was like, okay, asshole. Oh, <laughs> like, yelled it way too. That just left my mouth. Yeah, I didn't even get this thing twice. And then he did this thing where he he started to turn like he was a, like he jolted. He turned quickly, like he wanted, like he's reacting to what I said. But in doing so, he sideswiped like three or four cars really oh. fast. I parked alongside the road. Yeah, um, they were parked. They were parked, but. Uh-huh. It made me feel weirdly responsible. Okay. Um, no. But not not. N- There's also also he could have potentially just been losing control, and that's why he drove so close to me to begin with. But it also seemed like it might have been the uh, the, the previous. You wanted to stop. Okay. It was more likely. Uh huh. The movie. So I, uh, so I yeah I I, I just I turned around and I uh, I scurried away. <laughs> yeah. Did he was he he wasn't after you though or. He- you don't know? Oh, I don't know. I I, I, I scurried fast. Yeah, you gotta scurry. Yeah. You can't. All and right. then and then I went on with my delivery day. Yeah, that's the Sorry, best. I, that's I, the I, best way is just to, to, like I. I always like just like try to apologize and try to like get away from confrontation because I don't want like somebody somebody's like, hey, what do you look yeah. like? That's past the point of. Yeah. That was past the point of recovery. It's like even and then after that, if he got anywhere near me, I don't know what would. The guy could have had a gun in his car for all I know, you know. Yeah. And that could have been like it, that was his precious truck, probably. Somebody, um, yeah, that, somebody. On, I remember I got, I got like threatened on the bus. Somebody. You did. They were like, uh, "What did I, what happened on the bus?" Somebody's like, "I'm gonna." He said, "I'm gonna beat your ass." Somebody was like yelling at me on the bus. This was like a year ago. I remember that. <laughs> and I was just like, "I'm sorry. I don't even know why. I don't know what happened." I was just like. I apologize. <laughs> Whatever happened, and then he kind of calmed down. But I think he was having a bad day. Mm. I think I caught his eye. Was... Okay. Like we made eye okay, contact so by he... accident. Maybe he was just so fresh he, out of jail or something. Worked up. But uh, yeah. I said I'm sorry. <laughs> like... But then again, one time, one time I cut somebody off when I was on my bike, and then they like pulled over in their car, and then they got out, and I like biked at them really fast like yelling trying to like like do the bear it's like you know when you like if there's like a bear you either like play dead or yeah. try to get really aggressive <laughs> so i i've done both oh you saw a bear and you were no no oh, i'm just wow. saying like the people you know if you see a bear it's like i don't remember oh. or a wild animal it's like what you, you either you're either supposed to like get real big and yell or play dead yeah, yeah. so like i play I've, I've done both with potential confrontations and they both worked out for me where I didn't have to actually yeah. do anything, you know. I've never been in a physical. Uh, that's not true. 
I've never been like the guy pushing it. You know, I've always oh, yeah. been the guy getting hit. hit. <laughs> yeah. I got punched. At, they said I got punched at an MGMT show. <laughs> oh, is that why you were really? Always talking about MGMT, you were traumatized, and now you're. It's like you always talk about it. <laughs> it's a weird, weird, weird coping mechanism. Yeah. To talk about it all the time. No, it was during Electric Seal though. Try to push forward to my friends, and, and some bro wasn't having it. <laughs> it clocked me, and then I, I went and sulked in the back. Yeah, but but then I, then I met a girl, so it was a nice ending. But. Oh, okay. I got, I got hit, though. Does it help you move, mend your wounds? I think it did. I think it did, I think, yeah. But, like, on purpose, so. or was she like, oh, really, you were hit, and then, like... I, th I think that worked to my advantage, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Were you okay? Was, it, was it a bad hit? That was a while ago. Was it stuck where you... No, it, it, no, it wasn't a really bad hit, but it was more like... If that, if I, yeah, if there wasn't something that cheered me up after that, it might have been... I might not have been able to listen to MGMT after that night. Um, yeah. But no, it was more like the, it was more like the idea. That I was like, oh, that was a happy moment, and some guy just felt the need to hit me, so I had to go like sit in the sidelines and reconvene. Well, we only have about a minute left today. Get back together. Show's about yeah. over. Guys, I was okay, bye. Last night and oh, I bye. Was and it's tick on myself. Oh no! Just now? Inside? Yeah. I, I like just yanked on it, or like, just picked off like it was something oh, that I no. probably not. But I was sleeping. Good know? thing you found it. Get checked yeah. out for, like, Lyme disease or something. I know. There's a good cat dog episode about a tick. I recommend looking for it. Oh, uh, I'm not to, not to freak cat. you out, but like, I remember I saw the, like, the documentary about Bikini Kill, and... The, the singer of Bikini Kill got bit by a tick and got Lyme disease but didn't know it and didn't do anything about it and then had Lyme disease for a long time and messed her up. Yeah. Yeah, I uh, uh, yeah. My mom's husband has had Lyme disease for years and he stays very healthy with it. So. Oh, Not man. That you should but if you get it checked, if you Lyme have it and then you get, you get it treated quickly, then it's okay. But if you have it for a while, mess If you let it linger, oh, okay. Uh, well, hey, sorry, that's too bad. I don't know. Oh. <laughs> thanks, Gene. Thanks for talking to us today. <laughs> thanks. <laughs> yeah, thanks, the yellow fella. Uh, Gene. Thanks, Grandma uh, yeah. and Andrew and Mark, guitar player. Uh, we, we made it. Gene, keep calling us to tell us if, how you're feeling. Oh, Gene. Oh, yellow fella left. I guess everybody left. Here's the credits. <laughs> Thanks for watching. It's Tuesday. We're on TCTV channel 22, 11, 30, 2 a.m. Check it out. Yeah, what is your film? Dot com. Three, six, zero, eight, six, two, three, four. Call me message. Get on TV. Yeah. What did I say? Number three. Thank you, thank you, hell yeah, dog! Bye!